I can't believe that just happened. I can't believe that just happened. Yo, this your boy Jive Turkey from the Dos Uno. Madre. Maldito. Cinco. Que pasa? Yo dijo que pasa. Que pasa. What's going on, y'all? Chilling. Chilling, chilling, chilling. As you can chillin'. see, I'm playing some Call of Duty Modern Warfare HD. And I'm playing with my Beast co workers. And we are playing. I, I'm not even gonna lie. This is one of the better maps to me I, I you know it might it, it it might be in the next call of duty made by infinity ward because it's a fan favorite <laughs> that's just stupid uh we we collected the algorithms of the people who uh what maps they were playing the most well we gotta play one of the maps i i, I mean we gotta play one of the damn maps <laughs> I'm playing some. Oh. You heard him. He got killed with a handgun. With one shot. No, you didn't. You got killed by an assault rifle. I was there because I got killed too. I know. I know. I know. But I'm playing some good old Call of Duty. I know. I know. I don't know why I, I just can't stop playing this stupid game. Can't stop playing it. Black Ops 4, when that came out. I stopped playing it. I stopped playing it. I stopped. I like this game. I stopped playing it. I stopped. It's just some sometimes bad decisions just make your game terrible. And if if they're playing on the what 12 hertz servers, that battle nonsense that they're playing on, ah, they they after these microtransaction sales, they they need to upgrade this shit, please. Please, cause these please, things are please, this this one. Please, I, I, I said it. I said it. Um, uh, like maybe during the beta, I was like, yo, like sometimes when I get killed by a MP5 or M4, any fast shooting weapon, it feels like I got sniped or hit by a shotgun or something like that. It really does. It feels like I got sniped or hit by a shotgun. And then you look at it in the kill cam and be like, oh, wh what? Man. But, uh, you know, skill-based matchmaking is still a thing. It's, <laughs> it's, it's not going to not be a thing. It's always going to be a thing. It's going to be on the next Call of Duty and the next one and the next one. I just think that... They're using it like like we said they're protecting the players so they can refer it to other kids or other people at work or you know I think that's what they're doing somebody said that they're the people who buy microtransaction gets into new lobbies so they can see the weapons or the, the skins or something of the people they're killing or if they got killed and the person pick up the weapon, what the hell? This, this, this was crazy. I can't believe I got away. I think he's, he's, he flashed me and then he's rushing me like, like a beast. See, that, that's what I, that's what I like. This dude said, you know what? I'm going to go kill Jeff. Oh, 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 guys, I'm dead. You dead. Don't rush Jeff. Because you will die. But if they're really doing that, this is like above and beyond. Black Ops 3 and Black Ops 4 is when they really should have did it. Because they're kitty childish games. Like Call of Duty is a kitty game. We all know that. Call of Duty is Call of Duty. Who shoots? The, I always say who shoots the most bullets and 
Any mini miny mo that that's how they choose the who wins the gunfights. But they would have made a killing. Especially I think Black Ops 3, because that's when they had all the stupid dances in it and stuff. Man, they should have did it then. Well, skill based matchmaking was in the game, but it wasn't as strong as it is now. I swear it's super strong. That clip at the beginning was me on the troll name. I don't know if I forgot to even bring it up for some. I don't know why I didn't bring it up. But that clip at the beginning was me on the troll name, just running around, just bored, having fun, bored of playing against the MLG super pros. So I just pop turned signed in on the other name and then that happened I was like wow like like he jumped over me I honestly think like I stunned him or he was kind of flashed and then he just jumped over me but that was an enemy man an enemy it wasn't a private lobby it that was real <laughs> like those lobbies are really that bad man and I can't like get I tried everything guys I tried to get like the worst player out of my job to host the party and you know invite me and then invite the rest of the guys and then match make I tried I tried doing the matchmaking it, it's just it just doesn't work but when I played on that name solo and went in by myself it doesn't have any friends on the friends list. It's just a name, you know. But when I go in on that name, it is so easy. The lobbies are so easy. And I don't know if they're really trying to sell microtransactions to everybody, but it, sound, it sounds crazy, right? It sounds crazy, like, when people are explaining it, like, you got to buy uh, like a microtransaction. You got to buy a microtransaction. Then you get put in the noob lobbies of people who don't have the gun or the skin. And you kill a couple of them or they kill you and pick up the weapon. And they'd be like, oh, wow, let me buy that thing. It sounds crazy, but it honestly, I can't put it past Activision, man. And I always used to say, like, yo, it's it's not David Vonderhaar doing this stuff. It's, you know, he's the scapegoat or 402. We like picking on them because Piccadilly. Because they're like the, the face of the company at the moment. So that's why we pick on them. But any grown man or whatever knows that it's the developers. That's why I was so high on Battalion 1944. Like, I, I I hate World War II, this and that, but I, they weren't, like, controlled by anybody. They they had that it was an independent game. But when they said they just want to be pro-driven, like, everything was going to be, like, pro and competitive, that's where they lost everybody. I'm telling you, if they had made that game, like, casual... And then had a little, like, a pro circuit or whatever. I don't know how much money you got to kick out to have a skill-based matchmaking playlist. But that's what they should have done. That game would have done so well. Because they wouldn't have had to listen to Activision, EA, anybody. They would have just had to listen to themselves, listen to the fans. When they said they're just going pro... <laughs> Big mistake. Big mistake. And remember, Big mistake. Big mistake. Big Cersei Lannister. Now nah, that's a chick. Um, Tom Brady is the Jive Turkey of quarterbacks. I'm out.